be a mess. Uh, parking is going to be a mess. You know, not used to are sell sold out. out. Yeah. Not used to sell out to Petco, and they're going to have three in a row here. Boy. <laughs> Thanks, Leslie. All right, so much for empty nesters. Moms and dads can't wait to get rid of their kids, the adult ones anyway. Jane King is standing by at the New York Stock Exchange. Good morning, Jane. <laughs> Hi, David Alexis. Yeah, better clear out the basement, right? We'll have that story here in a second. But big jobs report out today, a monthly report that we get every month. Uh, the U.S. added 162,000 workers last month. So that was less than what was expected. Uh, we did see average hours spent on the job go down and average hourly pay go down as well. So kind of a weak job report. The unemployment rate did, though, fall to 7.4 percent. That's the lowest in nearly five years. The White House this morning blaming sequestration. Uh, for some of this anemic job growth that we're seeing. Now, how is it that employment data impacting uh, trading this morning? Well, we are lower. Wall Street seems to be focusing on the negatives in that report. Uh, the Dow right now is down about 30, and the S&P and NASDAQ slightly lower. Okay, moms and dads, uh, get ready for the kids to move back home. A Pew study found a record 21.6 million millennials live with their parents. There's a variety of reasons. 18 to 31-year-olds aren't leaving the nest. Uh, they can't find jobs. Many are delaying marriage. Moms home cooking and free laundry that doesn't hurt either a lot of those kids to be fair are also going to college while they live at home and taco bell knows when it's uh, got a good thing going it's teaming up with frito-lay yet again for a new flavor of doritos locos tacos tweeting about it in a vine video promising to add more heat this summer with its arrival august 22nd following the launch of the wildly successful nacho cheese and cool ranch flavors so in a recent conference call owner of taco bell young brand said it sold a hundred million Doritos Locos Tacos in the last quarter. A hundred million. That's more than a million every single day. Live at the New York Stock Exchange, I'm Jane King. Bloomberg News reporting for KUSI News. David Alexis, back to you. You got something popular. Why not? Just keep selling them. <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> Absolutely. Yeah, it's hard to find something that catches with the public, so run with it. And hey, Jane, I'm a huge <laughs> fan of Pinterest. Love it, but I understand they're adding some sort of new feature. Uh, they are. It's a site, of course, for those who are not familiar, where users can pin or post things that they like from around the web. You know, maybe it's a necklace, something for your home. Well, Pinterest says now it will send pinners an email when the price of the item drops that they're interested in. Now, you're not going to see it right away since the site is slowly rolling it out. But the new feature could really drive sales for brands with a Pinterest presence. Hmm. That would be a lot of emails for me. I mean, just based on the amount of things I pin. Exactly. <laughs> it's a good site. Yeah, yeah, it really is. I'm always addicting. on there looking up stuff to do with the kids. Yeah, yeah. and stuff for your house. It's great. Yeah. Okay, right. Jane, thanks. Yeah. Have a great weekend. Thanks, Jane. Okay. Straight ahead on Good Morning San Diego, a flying car Come that may one day change me. the face let's of transportation, fly, a la George away. Jetson. <laughs> Plus, a thief <laughs> makes off with a dumpster. You Tell you more about this curious bear. The Bloomberg Financial Report, brought to you by California Bank and Trust. This is California Banking. We understand the challenges of running a business, any size business. It's about being business strong and having the right bank to leverage your potential. Visit calbanktrust.com slash San Diego, member FDIC.